Hey everyone, today I got a 20 horsepower V twin Kohler engine. You can see the model number here CV624S. What we have going on is a leaky oil seal bottom side. First thing we'll want to do is remove this set of pulleys for the the deck and the pulley in the back for the drive belt. Take an impact 5.8 socket, uh, remove that. We have that removed. This will just pull right off. This clip, you want to just pull up on the uh, mating clip, pull that up, remove that tab. Then you can remove the drive belt. Pull your second pulley off. So to remove the seal, I just take a drill and a long screw and put some force and try and screw the sheet metal screw into the seal. So there it started. You just take your claw hammer Put it on the end of the, of the screw and pull back. There your seal pops out like that. Just take a rag, clean everything up really good, get any metal shavings, any dirt, you know, anything out of the way before you put your new seal on. So I just got this seal, 250326S, identical seal the old one and we'll go ahead and install it. So this seal has grease on the inside. Probably don't need to grease it but I'm just going to take this uh, gasket maker that I use for case halves, put those together. I'm going to put that around the outside to make sure the seal doesn't come out. the seal and you just want to push it in as far as you can just with your hands and you'll want to keep it straight as much as you can it's about as far as I can get it and then we'll go and tap it into place I'm just going to take my old seal piece of plastic pipe put it like that slide it over the shaft and then just tap the new seal in with your hammer. So the seal is in, got it in about an eighth of an inch. Wipe away any excess sealer. I installed the seal a little bit more than what it was. You can see where the old seal was, but not all the way back. If you go all the way back, you're going to cover the hole that connects uh, this area to the crankcase. And lastly, I'm just going to take some gasket maker here, Permatex. I'm going to go around the outside of where the seal was. And there you have the seal finally, finally installed. Go ahead and reassemble. Should be good to go. Thank you.